welcome. How does Google collect data for Google Maps? Google's stated mission is to organize the world's information and make it universally accessible and useful and it is making good on this, on this promise. However, Google is gathering even more information than most of us realize. 1. Searches Web, images, news, blogs, etc. Google is, as you all know, the most popular search engine in the world with a market share of almost 70%, for example, 66% of searches in the US are made on Google. Google tracks all searches, and now with search becoming more and more personalized, this information is bound to grow increasingly detailed and user-specific. 2. Clicks on search results not only does Google get information on what we search for, it also gets to find out which search results we click on. Web crawling, Googlebot, Google's web crawler, is a busy bee, they all continuously reading and indexing billions of web pages. 3. Website Analytics Google Analytics is by far the most popular website analytics package out there. Due to being free and still supporting a number of advanced features, it's used by a large percentage of the world's websites. 4. Ad Serving AdWords and AdSense are cornerstones of Google's financial success, but they also provide Google with a lot of valuable data. Which ads are people clicking on, which keywords are advertisers bidding on, and which ones are worth the most? All of this is useful information. 5. Email Gmail is one of the three largest email services in the world, together with competing options from Microsoft, Hotmail, and Yahoo. Email content, both sent and received, is parsed and analyzed. Even from a security standpoint this is a great service for Google. Google's email security service, Post and I, gets a huge amount of data about spam, malware, and email security trends from the huge mass of Gmail users. Google has now also crowdsourced the collection of real-time traffic data via mobile phones. The way in which they are doing this is pretty cool, and may prove to be a way to someday provide quality real-time traffic data for all roadways. If you have a Google Maps installed on a mobile phone with GPS capabilities enabled, your location can be transmitted to Google in real time, allowing them to determine the fact that you are on a particular road and traveling at a certain pace. When Google combines your speed with the speed of other phones on the road, across thousands of phones moving around a city at any given time, they can get a pretty good picture of live traffic conditions. Google continuously combines this data and sends it back to you for free in the Google Maps traffic layers. In this way, Google can now offer traffic reports for secondary roadways, routes not necessarily containing dot sensors. Furthermore Google collects data by mapping agencies, Android data, ways, street view, check-ins, now defunct, map maker and other input tools. Hope you understands how Google collects data for Google Maps. Thank you.